すまでも見つめていたい。また明日なの。Kind of an animal. <laughs> an animal that feasts off its victims, and then when its belly is full, gets up and walks away. <clears throat> That's not very nice. Well, you're not a very nice person. Why do you say things like that to me? <laughs> Because it's true. You love me, and you know it. <laughs> uh, I despise you, and you know it. <sighs> Are you going to start this all over again? Who knows where something starts and when it stops? Oh, you're being silly and moody. I'm tired. I'm tired of trying to make believe that this, that this thing we've got is love. Look, look what you did to my arm. You scratched it like a panther. <laughs> I've got to go now. Witching hour. Please, don't go. Come on, don't leave me alone. Not now. <laughs> you know, I really don't know why I waste my time with you. You're really not much of a man, are you? Don't you talk to me like that. <laughs> I can afford to talk to you any way I please. I pay your rent, give you pocket money. And you take it too, baby. So don't give me that wounded bit. Love to cut just like a knife, don't. And why don't you do something about it? You know there are times that I would really like to kill you. Oh, really? Well, then why don't you? I dare you. Why do you make everything seem so ugly? <laughs> why do you make everything seem like utopia? You know, it just don't exist. Get wise, lover. Yeah, yeah. You would really like to drive me right down to your level. Oh, you're you? already there, sweetheart. You just don't know it. Why do I even put up with you? Yeah, why do you? Huh? No, better still, why do I put up with you? You're not even a good painter. As a lover, oh, a beginner. You're not really much of anything, Carla. You're nothing but a big, beautiful bowl of mush, baby. And without me, you're just one step away from the parade of pimps. <laughs> oh, is that the best you can do? You pig!
<laughs> Baby, don't you know? You're a loser every time. Get out. Just get out of here. That's right, baby. Get mad. You know, there may be some hope for you yet. Look, just leave me alone, huh? Just stay away from me. <laughs> I'll expect to hear from you when it runs out. to the warm greeting. Say, what happened to you, bad dad Black Rock? Never mind, never mind. <laughs> hey, remember how I was thrown out of my place a couple of weeks ago on Bleecker Street? Yeah. Huh? Well, you'll never, you'll absolutely never guess what happened today. You were thrown out again, huh? Yeah, Perry Street this time. <laughs> my luck. <laughs> hey, that's not bad. Not bad at all. Just Thank a little you. too much color over there. What are you talking and about? And as I was saying, my color. landlord, that benevolent that's SOB, beautiful. Tossed me out in the street just like I was an old discarded icebox. Hey, Ty, that's not bad. Something new has been added. You're getting style. I like it. What is this? Early famine? <laughs> Anyhow, here I am. A, a, a poor, helpless creature tossed out into the cold. <laughs> and you need a place to stay. Huh? Ty, baby, I knew I could depend on you. <laughs> <Get off. laughs> Come on. Hey, what is all this stuff? This? This, my fine and fanciful friend, is clay. Clay extracted from the deep, dark depths of Mother Earth. Here, give a smell. Did you ever smell anything like that in your whole life? Clay, when touched by my artful hands. Such creative genius will turn this lump of clay into such a work of art 
that'll absolutely knock the spiral right out of the Guggenheim. I've got another can outside. Well, come on, let's go get it. <laughs> From these sordid surroundings, beauty will spring forth. Beauty such as the village has never known. Never mind and about the sordid surroundings. Come on, give me a hand. I'll be with you in a minute. Now let me see, where's the best northern light? No, not over there, not the corner. Oh, this looks pretty good. Hey, say, Ty, would you mind if I moved your easel? Dad! Oh. Oh, let me give you a hand with that. Yeah, never mind. Oh. This is it. Oh, so it is. Hi, baby. You are a noble young nitwit. You've got an open face, an open heart, an open door. Thank God. You live to be loved and must be loved to live. Your soul is pure American. <laughs> Incidentally, about the rent. <laughs> if you expect me to chip in now. Don't worry about it. <laughs> well, I guess as long as you have Lisa, the great provider, we're yeah, okay. Lisa. Sure. God, I've got to get some money. I threw it all back to her. What? <laughs> Look, uh, Stan, you stay here and make yourself at home. I've got to get over to the club to see her. Look, I'll explain it to you later. Oh, help yourself to a drink, <laughs> if there's any left. Youth. It's such a nervous disorder. Uh, nothing. Hey, where's Lisa? I gotta see her. Down, boy. She's around somewhere. Oh, have you looked under any tables lately? Anybody tells you you look good, slug them. Hey, sit down. Well, what's the kick? Uh, you know, same old thing. Lisa, huh? Our little sex symbol been putting you down? I don't know what it is. Nothing seems to be going right. I can't paint. I can't do anything. I feel like I'm being smothered. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm hip, man. You're bugged. And I know what you need. What's that? Nothing. Josh was just driving. Weren't you, Josh? <laughs> Thank 
से आते You cool it, man. Buddy, don't sweat it. Come over here, honey. Mashiko, I'd like you to meet Ty. Ty, this is Mashiko. <laughs> honey, you were groovy on time. Yes. Yeah, you were great. Honey, our boy Ty here has a problem. You think we could sort of uh, help him out, like guide him up the path to eternal freedom? Why don't you lay off? Why don't you butt out, Batman? I'm just looking out for Ty's welfare. <laughs> Ty's got problems, and we're all concerned, right? Isn't that right, Mashiko? He needs a release, man, and it's up to us to show our brother the light. Dig me? Hey, come on, cut it out, Josh. You need a new dream, right? A few old revelations? Look. Put yourself in Daddy Josh's hands. You wish to experience beautiful rapture? Wish to feel power of the earth and the sky. Oh, the sky above and the mud below. <laughs> hey, what is all this, John? In my world, dream become truth. Ideal in fantasy. Anamorphic images. Oh, oh, dig my man, Webster. Mystic revelations. Hey, uh, maybe I'm drunk, but... But I don't get what, you, what you're rapping about at all. LSD. LS what? LSD. It's the newest thing in dreams. Instant psychoanalysis, baby. Hey, if you're talking about what I think you're talking about, uh-uh. No, you got the wrong vision. I like my nightmares just the way they are. Man, you don't know until you get turned on yourself. Ah, uh, you're pushing, Josh. Put my man. I said, forget it. If you should bend your mind. Yeah, but I won't, baby, son. But if you should, dear, you can reach me anytime. Anytime. Hey, Arnie. What'll it be, Ty? Uh, uh, bourbon. No, a double. No, anything. I don't care. So I'm gonna wind up in a nice little heap right here. stuff alone. That's not the trouble cure you need. Just, just one little impregnated sugar cube and... No, 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 no. No, you don't have any cure for my hang-up. So you just... You just push your little sugar cubes away. Because I got my own cure. Right here. Tonight. Now, she's showing you the merchandise. 
So here she is, ready for the highest bidder. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he makes such a lovely bath mat. Are you all right? Huh? Yeah, 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 I'm, I'm fine. Do you, uh, live around here? Oh, it's, uh, down there. It's, it's around the corner. Come on. I'll take you home with me. Okay? Huh? Uh, wait, wait. Sorry, old man. What do you want? You take it. Just get out. Leave me alone.
Which was it, lover? A hot shower or a cold one? I don't understand. <laughs> Excuse me. I know. You're both kind. Chico? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Not yet. I'm king of the universe. If anybody wants the answer, must come and see me. my friend. This is Maria. I can feel the power of the ocean and the waves caressing my shoulders. <laughs> it is a wonderful form of escape. Come. I'll show you. Into a wonderful world of fantasy. 
lasting for hours, sometimes for days. And this is a, what did you call it? It is deep. A doctor friend of mine has been doing research with it. We are part of his experiment. Indeed. It produces strange mental transformation. It sometimes changes the personality. Is that good? One man's kicks is another man's psychosis. <laughs> you are strong, young. It will not harm you. It will only free you. agony and the ecstasy of it all. No rocks and no boulders, Dad. just heavenly shoulders and Dad. oodles and oodles of five. Dan, huh? how much longer are you going to be? I've been sitting here for seven hours. A, a day, a week, a month. That was genius. There's no time limit. Is this thing really supposed to be me as Lady Godiva? That it is, my little inspiration. That it is. But aren't I assuming the wrong position if I'm supposed to be Lady Godiva? Believe me, with you in that position, nobody's going to miss the horse. Hmm. But I understand Lady Godiva was fat, and I'm not like that. Artistic license, my pet. Artistic license is not only Lady Godiva, it's Venus, Aphrodite, it, it's every woman uh, that is irresistible. And only to be dressed in a dollar ninety-eight cent special in Macy's window. Oh, hello, Lisa. I haven't heard from him yet. Oh, where the hell is he? It's been three days now. Hello. I'm worried. Tyler's young, a bit confused. He's a sensitive boy, but believe me, he can take care of himself. Stanley. Stanley! You're not lying to me. Don't get emotional, Lisa. It doesn't become you. I told you the truth. But look, he tore out of here three nights ago like he was caught in a police raid, and I haven't heard from him since. And he hasn't called. Well, I'm going to call the police then. Lisa, hold up a minute. Lisa! Don't be ridiculous, Lisa. You'll get everyone involved for nothing. He'll come back when he's ready. Don't worry. He's probably just out somewhere shacking up with a friend. Thinking things out, mind you. Just thinking things out. Yeah. Yeah, you're probably right. But what worries me is... Who's the friend?
Well, well, well. The prodigal son has returned. Hey, coffee pot's gone. <laughs> you look like you need it. How are you, Lisa? How are you, Lisa? the best you can do? What do you want me to say? For three days you have been missing. I must have been up here a dozen times. That's that nut he's using in the studio. Oh, what's the difference? What's the difference? Yeah, that's right. What difference does it make where I've been? Did it ever enter into that hazy brain of yours that I might have been worried that something had happened to you? No. No, it never did. Oh. Create something as beautiful as this. Stan's got it. I think he's a genius. Look, I don't give a damn about Stan. I did not come up here for a critical analysis of his work. My sweet, sensitive Lisa. Oh, he does. He does very nice work. Is that better? She's beautiful. She almost looks as if she were alive. <laughs> yeah, doesn't she? But if she isn't, then I am <laughs> very much alive. I've missed you. It's over, Lisa. Everything. The whole arrangement, it's... All over. You know, Lisa, you can go along forever. Everything is manageable. All sorts of excuses to yourself. But you say, what the hell? This is life. Yeah, you've got to accept all kinds of things just to stay alive. And then all at once, baby, everything goes snap. And you just don't give a damn anymore. Oh, you're spoiled, Lisa. Spoiled? 
self-indulgent, rotten, and... Now, what's the use? Oh, no, Tyler. No, no. Go on and finish, Tyler. I'm loud, right? And I'm vulgar. And a lot of other things you haven't mentioned yet. Maybe I am. But I've had to be because of a lot of cloud flutters like you who never come down to earth long enough to pay the rent. No matter what you say, no matter what you think about me, I know there is something better in this life. Look, almost anything would be better than all this waste, this insane struggle. Oh, no, baby. No, you listen to me. I have got talent, damn it. I know it's there, but I have got to prove it to myself. This is something I just can't ignore. I need somebody. I need somebody who cares. You're not it, Lisa. Tyler! Oh, it's you. Get out. I said get out! What do you want? What are you looking at, you fool?
Oh. No. Who did this? God. See you again! You got that? That's clear!
Please. No, don't do that. I'm not going to hurt you. I just want to talk to you. Well, well, I don't even know you. I'm Tyler, Tyler Weston. Oh. Oh. You know Stan Jacobs, don't you? Yes, but what has Stan Jacobs got well, to do? He uses here? my studio. Remember, I'm Tyler, Tyler Weston. Oh, yeah. Was that you running down the stairs the other day? Yes. Oh. Look, I don't want to frighten you, but I've got to talk to you, and I have got to find out where Stan is. Do you know? No. Isn't he in the studio? No, I went there, and everything's gone. All this stuff is missing. Well, I don't know. Listen, oh. I'm in terrible trouble, and I think maybe you can help me. Can we go someplace and talk? Maybe have a cup of coffee? Well, all right. Freezing. Let's get out of here. Come on. The whole thing has been like, like some kind of a nightmare. I can't even go back to the studio. I'm probably calling the police by now, but they're probably all over the village looking for me. Stan must know something about this. If I only knew where to find him. Now, mind you, I don't think Stan had anything to do with it. I, well, he's just not the type. He isn't? You don't know him very well, do you? I used to think he was just some kind of a harmless nut. But he fooled. I know he fooled me. What do you mean? Well, when the statue was finished, he tried to. I don't want to talk about it. A stick, though, doesn't need a reason. Yeah. Got to find him. Maybe he'll call me. He does sometimes. All right, look. Look, when he calls you, make a date to see him. But I'm afraid of him. Don't worry. I'll be there. And what do you think you can do? I don't know. I don't know when the time comes. seen her, Josh. I, I haven't seen her for days. Yeah, well, we thought uh, if anybody knew that you would. I said I haven't seen her. You got that? Yeah, I got it. Right. Have you seen Stan? No, he hasn't been in here all day. I heard he got a victim from his pad. Yeah, yeah, I know all about that. Look, when you see him, will you tell him that I... Uh, never mind. Hey, what do you suppose happened to Lisa? is as good as mine. It's kind of rough to figure that brought out, huh? Yeah. Hey, you cutting up? Uh, yeah. You want me to tell Stan you are? No, uh, just forget it, will you? Just forget it. Sure. Hi, Marmon. Hi, Liz. Oh, the usual. You see this? It's just awful. It's getting so a girl isn't safe even in the village. You know, I knew this guy, Tyler. Yeah? Yeah, he wanted to take me out once. But I said no, because he was a creep. There's something weird about his eyes, you know what I mean? Mm. Excuse me, could you give me a light, please? Uh, yeah. Sure. All right. Where'd you meet this guy? Oh, let's see. It was a party about a year ago, I think. Well, a whole bunch of us went down to, uh... Hey,
Hello. Stan, how are you? I've wondered why I haven't heard from you. I went by the studio the other day to see the statue, but no one was there. No, no one was there. Um, not even Tyler. The door was locked. Yes. Yes, I'd like to see you, too. When? This afternoon. Mm -hmm, all right. Um, well, no, no, you can't come here. Um, I'll meet you someplace. All right. Uh, in an hour. A and Stan, uh, if I'm a little bit late, uh, wait for me because I have to get dressed. Uh, all right. Bye. Don't be nervous. I'll be right here. Maybe. Oh! Tyler! I know you're there. Now, if you know what's good for you, get going! The police are looking for you, not me. I told them all about you and Lisa. Tyler, do you hear me? Let the girl go, Stan. See, I'm crazy? Take off and I'll let her go. Maybe. You did do it, Stan. Why? Why did I do it? I don't know. I, I, when I got back to the studio, Lisa was there. Lisa. She destroyed the statue, Ty. It was the best thing I've done. Like destroying part of me. I just went crazy, I guess. Damn, Lisa! She was no good, Ty. She deserved to be killed. After she was dead, I gathered up all the pieces and cleared out. After all, only you and Lisa knew how I was using the studio. You forget I knew. No, I haven't forgotten. That's why you're here. Stay away, Ty. I'm warning you. I'm getting out of here and I'm taking her with me. Now, don't try to follow us. I'm warning you. Look! 
Ty. Ty. Tyler. Huh? Hey, wait a minute. What? Oh. Oh, it's you, Nick. What in the hell are you doing out here in broad daylight? Hey, man, don't you know they're looking for you? Yeah, yeah, I know. I know, but I didn't do it, Nick. Oh. I swear to God, I didn't. You have to convince me. I believe you. Do you need a place to stay? No. No, I've got to find Stan. He did it, Nick. He killed her. He even admitted it to me. Oh, Stan. I always knew he was a little baddie. Yeah, but you, you knew him better than the rest of us. I felt sorry for the clown. Hey, wait a minute. Josh got to him the other night, gave him some LSD. And he went completely crazy, went out of his mind. That probably explains what happened. I've got to find him. Where would he go? He's got a car, you know. Oh, that means he could be any place. What am I going to do? Go to the police. No, no. Tell them the truth. No. I'll go with you. Hey, wait a minute, wait a minute. He used to tell me about a dam he used to go to out on Highway 4. Said he went out there whenever he wanted to be alone. He asked me to go along a couple of times. Give it a try. Okay. Look, loan me your cycle. I'll go with you. You may need some help. No. He's got a girl with him. I don't know what he might do. I've got to handle him alone. All right, man. But if he's out there, somebody's got to go for the cops. Okay. Are you all right? Yes, I am, but stop, Sam. Yeah. 